Greetings everyone, Ajon here, another couple years to replay. Spawn on the bottom left side as the Austria player of Call Me Son. So on the north side as the red UKF, we have Aiden Fungi, who's immediately locked, both players immediately locked, locked in a doctrine. We have the Lend Lease Assault Regiment for the Assault Infantry Sections, and we have Strategic Reserves for the Assault Grenadiers. And this map is very wide open, and I'm not a huge fan of either of those options at this exact moment. But it could also be for this uh, Mortar Team, the Mortar Team, of course, being a mobile mortar. Wasn't paying attention to what they're chatting about. Infantry section of Tommy's has been trained. We do have a raid uh, assault infantry section now out on the field. Universal carrier built and ready. Gear stowed and ready to go. Carrier ready to move off. Okay, I've really not been paying attention. I've been looking at these guys over here. Right up the volume 14. Now they're talking about some sort of book. What type of book it lasts for, 40, for 14 volumes? Other than the boxcar children and Hardy Boys. Fuck. It's been a while since I last even heard about those. It's probably middle school. <laughs> and you got the universe carry here. Heavy Cup here will make a good engagement for these pioneers. They're getting some really good pens. A new infantry section is ready for battle. Our two raids uh, assault sections have armed with stens. There is an MG42, and the assault sections do, of course, have access to smoke. Smoke was upgraded. Assault section upgrade so it acquires the uh, the MG40, uh, the Thompson. Requires veteran one for the white phosphorus and the Mills bomb research from the uh, base. Great suppression coming on out. Assault grenadiers are also here, which are doing some good work against the field point. But I'm pretty sure Ray, the assault infantry sections are technically better if placed in a one v one vacuum. But the universal carrier may go down. Uh, he doesn't want to get too close. Two assault grenadiers versus two uh, assault uh, Tommies. Looks like the assault grenadiers do manage to win out this engagement. Loaded up and ready to move. And the universal carrier is alive. He's getting out some sappers now. Universal, universal carrier is using the uh, repair ability. Getting this uh, cut off point, but there's nothing to cut off. Actually. Supply lines been cut. These assault grenadiers are severely wounded. They will have trouble winning in the, uh, the next engagement. The OKW, I mean the Australian player, needs to build out a bunker now. He has enough fuel for the bunker. Or not fuel, munitions. Because this guy is far, far too weak in order to fight, uh, to, uh, fight these uh, assault sections. We do have this uh, bunker setting on up. He does not have that one, nor does he have the... Does get out of the arc in time. And he will territory. abandon the building. He needs a retreat back. He can still get wiped right here. But Assault Grenadiers are on the retreat path. He does manage to escape on out. Assault Grenadiers are behind the heavy cover, but they're a bit wounded and they're hit by the uh, Universal Carrier as well. He's building the bunker now. He's also got the light like, mechanized company. Assault Grenadiers, I believe, can also help build the bunker. Likely a third assault section is coming out. Perfect time to get out a 2-2-2. Two, 2-2 two, two. Yes. Two, two, two on the build queue. Medics are being researched. How can we help? <sighs> he may just need to keep this uh, assault grenadiers. He needs to group the assault grenadiers stuff together or off. wait for the healing to come out. Because he needs those healing. These assault troops need their max health. Or else they will disintegrate. is now a field hospital. 
Healing's coming on out. We are losing a sector. He'll lose a lot of territory, but it's a necessary evil at this point. 2 2 is out on the field. Maybe a second 2 2 wouldn't be half bad, but that's with our caster vision. Has prioritized fire activated, and now he's bit blopping out. All of his force is right here. Flamers coming on out. Perhaps I would have gone for a minesweeper for myself. Fuel point cut off, fuel point being, being decaptured. He sees his two assault grenades, he won't be able to win that engagement. This assault section is severely wounded. Is trying to flank the MG42, does receive a bit of a burst there, but lost too many members. In fact, being uh, being prone to wipe, if the MG42 has not repacked up, he could actually got a wipe there. Vickers upgrade, 2-2-2, two to two, running on forward. He does not see the uh, sappers for AT grenades, so this will be an easy pick. There goes the universal carrier. The sappers will not be able to win out versus the assault grenades. In fact, he may lose that squad. No, he does not. Oh, yes he will. Medic's coming on out. He needs that healing because he also They're has enough conditions for a set of Thompsons as well. There is a landmine here, but you will not be able to sweep it unless, it's, if, unless you include feet as sweeping. Ooh, this guy's low health. I say capture and retreat back. Him hitting it with his scout car is both good and bad. Doesn't cause any manpower bleed, but knocks out his scout car for quite some time. I say retreat back. Sapper under fire by the regular Tommy squad. Half trap coming on out. Will he be using it as a transport? We're losing a capture point. No, nope, immediately upgrading to the quad. Times you should have some healing for these assault troops. Pioneers, of course, retreating back on home. Great suppression coming on out. He will see this half track. He was going to capture this point and probably retreat on back. And barely actually captured just in time because his other models were outside the uh, outside the radius. This guy needs to fall back. He does have some medics here. He needs a set, set up, uh, not sure what he's trying to do. Not gonna get any healing. <clears throat> Nothing guarding over here. MG42 is still in a good position. He sees the... He saw the quad half track. He could go for a pack 40. It's a bit iffy whether or not 2 to 2 can win against uh, against the M16. It all depends on positioning. The M16 can more than take out the uh, 2 to 2. He does have a pans, uh, Panzer Grenadiers of Panzer Tracks. And since he also went for the Strategic Reserves, they also have access to smoke grenades. Mortar team coming on out. Very nice. Just to displace that uh, MG42. He's going to unpack and probably repack it in this building. Pines, pioneers of Minesweepers will spot the assault section. There's no sapper on the field, which means no chance for extra additional mines. Oh, he may lose a squad. Looks like he will skip on out of there. And he will manage to get out of there. 2-2, two, 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 a bit wounded, but... Eh. There's one set of Thompsons now out on the field. Getting some good angles. Mortar crew barraging this uh, MG42 once again. Getting good hits. Pantastrex get one, two hits. He needs to pop out of the building. They have a late response. Assault Grenadiers making their advance here. There's only one assault section. No Mills bombs. 
does have access to. Oh! Bad retreat path. I don't think that was on purpose. I thought. He, I think he was trying to grenade assault the uh, Tommy squad, not the assault squad. Ooh, this MG42 needs to fall back and get some healing. Because one to two mortars would take him out. Pentrick squad receiving some mortar hits. Ooh, and that white uh, splash got him good. A defensive bunker here. Interesting. Does get a bit of this uh, uh, raid section. He's getting a bit too close, probably. If you reprioritize target, he can do some good damage. He got upgrade of Thompson's. Out of contact. Oh, mortar! This MG42 has to bail out that building. Bunker has been spotted, but does he capture that point? We Gets out of there. That mortar could have wiped out that squad, I believe. Does get suppressed by the quad, saving his mortar crew. Battle Phase 2 has been researched. Now he can get the veteran leaders, increasing his squad size up to 6. We've got the Support Armor Core, which will, of course, allow him to be able to build uh, the uh, Pens 4 H's. A regular Grenadier squad has been built, which is probably a good idea seeing all the raid sections. Though honestly, the Panzer Grenadier squad would have just done as just as well. Sitting up inside this building, he could throw a white fossil screen in grenade into it. Ooh, good mortar hit there. Getting some great hits on the 2-2. Two -two. Panzer Grenadiers. Not getting shots off. If he, if he would have fired both those shots, he could have got the kill on the half track. Me leaving barraging that building. This building's very low in health. A well placed mortar could destroy it. Finds the Thompson upgraded squad. Good smoke. He could be trying to run forward with white phosphorus. Nope, he's just going to run forward into the building. But there are going to be two assault grenadiers here. Neither of them with the uh, squad leader upgrade. Just a lot of munitions. Throws the assault grenades into the building, which will like. Oh, yeah, grenades no longer destroy these buildings. Pines Grenadiers running him forward. That squad's very low in health. 1 2, destroyed engine. Needs to focus fire. Regular gunfire can affect it. Ten can pen it. And there goes the quad half track. Oh, on the right side, Pioneers fighting the entry section. The entry section should be able to win out. Engine 42 set on up. A rifle grenade did was fired. Smoke grenade thrown. He's going to need to fall back. Have the squad fallbacks quite wounded. We have been worthy of a promotion. Watch the flanks. The more that come. White phosphorus. Yep. White phosphorus grenade. White phosphorus grenade was thrown, which forced him to take that squad back to get it healed up. Scout car is so low in health. So, so low in health. 
Thompson are running on forward. It will rip apart this uh, Flamer Squad, no problem. Our opponents are seizing a sector. Salt Grenadiers are making their advance. Pentrex, it's very, very blobby, that's for sure. Cromwell's out. Very, very nice. Throws out smoke to cover that retreat. Very nice. <clears throat> Panzer IV on the build queue. It looks like it's not the uh, Armored Skirt one. He has plenty of fuel for the Armored Skirt one. Get the extra armor. It really does help out. Maybe forgot about that this auction has the Armored Skirt Panzer IV. <clears throat> we have a forward structure under attack. Good hits on this bunker. One more shot and it'll go down. Frontier building has been lost. Missed there with the Panzer Shrek. He is going to hop in this building. The enemy is One pen there. The 222 is fully repaired if you use it to guard his flanks. Our lines of supply are disrupted. Light machine gun trying to do some work. But we'll get suppressed by the uh, MG42. Medic's right here. I guess healing up that uh, Vickers. Pioneers will get on out there. That's uh, AT got a miss, but it did pen the pan uh, pens for there. Charging forward with one of the Salt Grenadiers, trying to get the kill on that uh, six pounder. One more shot, the pens for will die. Pens of Strikes warding away the Cromwell. 2 2 is nearly at full health. And he will force back that six pounder. Panzer IV will take a bit of time to be repaired. And the MG42 now needs to fall back and get healed up as well. We are losing a sector. Ooh, Cromwell getting good hit onto the 2 2 2. No pack gun. Rolls a miss there. And the 2 looks like we'll escape on out. Assault Grenadier is going to receive assault. He does have enough munitions for our squad leaders now for his Assault Grenadiers. It's probably a good idea to get that now. Enemy forces are securing our territory. Drive grenade thrown. White Phosphorus? Yep. And he will stop the capture there. Hops inside the building. Hands far fully repaired. No Pinto Mount being researched. One Assault Leader is being researched. White Phosphorus thrown on top of this group. No, that's just regular smoke. Needs to get this Grendir out of the building. 22 getting some great hits. Pop in and Kraska on the other side. Those are white phosphorus. Six pounder receives a hit. A very small hit. Panchex running on forward. Spots the Cromwell. One, one pen. This wasn't fully prepared as well, so I think it may be enough so it takes three shots to death, not four. And the Carmel's gonna be given pursuit. No telemines in the area. 222 does receive a miss there. Panstrex game we've seen multiple deadly mortar heads. Needs to fall back. May throw a bundle grenade. Nope, it does not.
Those out soul grenades not responding. Ooh, good hits. This one is the one that's upgraded the squad leader. The other one is not. Water smoke has rained on in. Does get crushed right there. Good pen there. Good hit there. S mines have been laid on down. There's a brick. No, that's a teller mine there. Assault grenades have been thrown, but largely missed. The enemy is attempting to steal our sector. Does barely get in the capping zone. And I think this... Oh, this could be really bad. I think he's coming to bring this over to run over the landmines. But there's a stellar mine here. We are losing a sector. Good mortar smoke. But he may still get suppressed. Yeah, he will get suppressed there. And he's denying the capture as well. He does not find the Telemind. Telemind's a bit of a weird spot. Tensor 4 may get a good rear armor hit. I think a white frost of smoke was thrown as well. Yep, white frost was smoke uh, thrown there. His guy got a bit of it. Goes out Gammon Bomb. Full retreat and. Garrison's inside that building, and Panzer IV just said, Nope, you're dead. So there goes his only infantry section. Great hits there. I think that's two sh two shots until four death. Panzer Grenadier's rushing on forward to support. Blitzing on out of there. Rolls a miss. And six pounder is firing. It may be a good idea just to just back off. You don't know what he's going if there's a mine or what. Great bundle grenade. Tens four at full health, so it can be sent back into the fight immediately. Nice white phosphorus. No squad leader on the other squad. Throws out Gammon Bomb. Knocks this guy back in a bit into the Gammon Bomb. Great hits onto the scout car. Enemy causing trouble, trying to take one of our points. The tactical air force is sending support. Supplies looking a bit squiffy. Admittedly, that scout car has, should have been dead a long time ago. Comets being deployed. We've also got the loiters now available. Point is being overrun. Yes. Ooh. I just wanted to see a grenade thrown over that hedge. Either side could throw a grenade. But they don't have vision. We got a lot of resources stacked up, waiting for one more half command point. So he can bring out the Tiger Ace. He has the structure as well. He's ready for the Tiger Ace. Sort of a little bit late for that to pin him out. May see a bonus grenade here. No, not enough munitions. The 2 to 2 may actually go down. He just needed to focus fire it. But he got stuck reloading. Pioneer, repair that damn thing. One pen strike hit, two pen strike hits. Comet tank says hi. I think that's gonna be dead two to two. I 
Yep, that's a dead 2 to 2. And that gave him enough command points for the Tiger Ace. Are seizing a sector. Nice defensive MG42. Having trouble deploying the front line? Just put in nice. Ah, uh, at a cutoff point. Throws out smoke though. The enemy has broken our supply lines. Teller mine there. These teller mines could be very, very important. Hands of four. Rolls a miss there. Throws out a uh, white phosphorus on retreat. He sees the Comet tank, trying to go for the... He could get a Faust off. He's getting the Faust off. Bounce off him come from the Tiger tank. He does snare the engine of the, of the Comet. The AT gun is very problematic, as well as a Sapper squad for snares. That's enough for a snare. Pens for rushing on four, one shot away from death. Rolls a miss there. Snare on the Tiger Ace. Six pounder is the crude. One shot duel. Blitz out of there. Rolls a miss. This water's coming on in. This could be very, very bad for the Tiger Ace. There goes one of the one of the Salt Grenadiers. Good hits there. The commenting can't potentially take this out. He got extraordinarily unlucky, I would say, with that, uh, with that comet tank. Main gun destroyed, and there goes. He's got to practice a brave, a rocket run. Yeah, aircraft are running on in. Machine gun motor hitting the Panzer Grenadiers. Here comes the rockets. And there goes the Tiger Ace. Enemy has destroyed a Panzer. Squad of Pioneers has arrived. Yep, he didn't even realize it. The enemy is taking our territory. Pack 40 being deployed. He lost both his assault and deer spec with those aircraft. Oof. Rife grenade on top of the mortar. Does take it out. Oof. That hurt. And that's a. Uh, and that Grenadier squad needs to fall back. He sees there's smoke on top of the uh, MG42 before he got Enemy that. Uh, are securing our territory. Before that mortar went down. We are losing a sector. He went way too far forward, gets suppressed, not in the capture zone. Flamer doing some good work. Telemine could be tripped, doesn't look like it. Hold fire state is actually still activated. If that hold fire state was not activated, he could have actually detonated that landmine with a missed shot on the pioneers. Another Panzer Grenadier coming on out. Panzer 4 H coming on out as well. Looks like he canceled the Panzer Grenadier. Maybe get out another squad of LMG Grams would be great as well. Good smoke coming in out from the Cromwell. Though the point will be decaptured. Could, yep, throwing out a demo charge. 
He's not responding, not responding. Oof. Hands four out on the field. Immediately upgrading with the Pinto Mount. Pack four gets a good hit there. Rolls a miss. Now trying to crush these units. Does needs a retreat. Pa Panzer Four gets a great hit there. Trying to blitz on out there. Panzer strikes in the area. One hit. And that was the pack gun that got the kill. F I look like the Panzer is gonna get the kill, the Panzer Four is gonna get the kill, and the pack gun was gonna get the kill. That was a dead pal uh, Cromwell. Crush common take out on the field. Bundle grenade? Yep, bundle grenade on top of the six pounder. Com tank rolls a miss. Pack 40 does get a good hit there. Bet one now. No stun shot. Because he has satchel charge. Throws out white phosphorus. He's currently still suppressed. He's now recovering for suppression. He does dodge it while still maintaining the, in the, staying in the smoke. Very nice. Pioneer squad is going to hold the capture point while the LMG deals with the HMG. Those are regular frag. Not really good frag. A group of them are suppressed. The assault section does get pinned. And the LMGs are going ahead and hit this a six pounder. He has a bit of fuel. He can go for another. He could go for Stug. He also knows about those loiters, so he could go for an awesome one as well to shoot them down. He could also save up for go for a Panzer Warfer. Brumbar, I don't really see it. Brumbar's a little bit too expensive at this point. Getting out a handful of cheap assets probably a bit better. Saving up for a Tiger Tank? Probably not a great idea either. Good suppression. Good smoke, though the squad may still be spotted. Yep, the smoke flew out wide. Those are personal smoke. The Panstrex squad here will deny the capture. He's throwing out his own smoke or bundle grenade? Bundle grenade. Oh, an Austria mortar just came out. Gammon bomb. That squad is very spread out, so they only killed the gunner. And he actually did not get the captured either. Our foes have 300 points remaining. Increase your efforts. Commenting advancing. Frozen, throwing out a frag grenade? Round to the Grenadiers. Gets a good hit there. Panzer and a little bit too slow in the draw for a Panzerfaust. Six pounder. Does get a pen there. Pack 40 is still in the area. Gets a pen onto the Panzer 4. Another pen there. One shot till death. Enemy forces are securing our territory. Will stop the catch of the Panzer Grenadiers. And does get suppressed there. Throws out bundle grenades, forces the retreat. Building a bunker. I sort of disagree with that. Ooh, good hit. Mortar emplacement coming in out. 
And the Panzer Grenadiers are right here. He cancels right before the shots get off to get a full refund. Good hits onto the Comet Tank. Throws out a bundle grenade on top of the Mortar. And does a full retreat. The Mortar does not get decrewed. That's gonna be dead pioneer. White phosphorus being thrown. No regular frag. He can stick around and try to spin that squad. Bunker is not being upgraded with it with a pintel. Oh, and that does not stop the capture play. Does with the squad wipe. Six pounder does get a deadly hit there. Blitzing on out there, rolls a miss. More emplacement does get complete and melee gets upgraded. We have lost a gun on our first squad. Austria Mortar does go down. Warder is now available. Panzer Grenadiers can't engage this. Panzer IV are almost fully repaired. Gets a good hit there with the Panzer IV. And the bunker's now fully upgraded, but now this mortar pit can do a high explosive barrage or something on top of it. Good pen there. Vet 2, 6 pounder. Good, another good pen. Third pen. Setting up his MG42 and load of armor piercing rounds can quickly destroy that mortar place emplacement. And there goes the uh, bunker. Trying to take a point from us. That's a fresh infantry section with five man squad and friends. Trying to go for some uh, better firepower. And we do also now have the Tiger Ace now out on the field again. There could be some good Panzer Strikes hits. Is he going to brace it in time? Does brace it. There's an AT gun here as well. Comet Team trying to advance. Panzer Grenadier is severely wounded. Tiger Ace there. Panzer Four moving into support as well. Throws out. Is it going for a stun shot? No, it does not get the shot off in time. Likely going to see a snare and not enough munitions for the loiter. Hands forward rushing on forward. They need to focus this uh, six pounder. Does go down. And the MG42 is suppressing the units. I think he's. Nope, we're just reloading. These pioneers can throw a, a satchel charge on top of the mortar emplacements to destroy it. It's actually a perfect opportunity to do that. Panzer IV rushing on forward. Good hit on the Panzer IV. And go ahead and blitz on out of there. And the capture pack 40 will be very problematic for against the austere player. Mortar crew recruit should immediately start barraging this mortar emplacement. An emplacement is being attacked.
could. He needs to use the Spanish tricks on that mortar emplacement. Vickers trying to set him up, but don't worry about bundling the uh, Vickers. He needs to hit that mortar emplacement. One more shot should kick him out. Pensive 4 pushing on his way forward. Tiger Tank's actually way over here. It's pack 40 getting some good hits onto the Tiger Tank. And got another snared engine. Pensive 4 hit, does the crew of the pack 40. Bounce. And the Pensive 4 does get a pen. Blitzing over there, getting some good uh, hits. Needs to continue rotating the Tiger Tank. Good hit there, and there goes the Comet Tank. Tiger Ace needs to limp back home. He needs to destroy these AT guns. Warder coming on in. He's going to need to try to spot four. The Tiger Tank should withstand one run. Oh, that's nasty. There's no Pinto Mount, so the Tiger Tank should be able to limp out of the radius. Without being spotted for any more additional runs. In fact, the Panzer IV could stay in the radius, use the Pentamount to draw the fire. Let's see. Plenty of fuel. He needs a pair of fireflies. Doves out smoke, recaptures the mortar. The enemy is taking our territory. Can now accommodate an MG42. Enemy fire! Shows out uh, the white phosphorus as well. Vickers and MG42 uh, to dueling it out. Throwing a frag on top of the mortar team. Does get not. Uh, only gets one model. Max range. Didn't get the right spot. Color mine's still there. Captured Pack 40, sieging the bunker, takes it out. Good hit there on the Panzer IV. Six pounder recruited. Good hit there. Panzer Grenadier is getting ripped apart. Tiger tank still being repaired. Needs only has his two uh, squads of uh, pioneers left. Good suppression and the, the engine is now repaired so the Tiger Tank can just uh, roam around. Getting suppressed right there. MG42 providing suppressive fire. Grenade Warfare getting some good hits on the Vickers. Pans4 now fully healed. He's going to make his advance now. Got another comment on the build queue. I would say Fireflies. He needs Fireflies. Stays at max range, he should be able to find. Pants of four coming to support. Oh! Common Taker really shouldn't be that effective versus infantry. With the support of the M1 AT gun, two shots until death. Forced by the ground, rolls a miss. Tiger Tank is has its engine damage. Panda Shrek firing. Pack 40 there. Managed to escape on out of there. Has their uh, attention split across two different areas. 
Kaltik now advancing, quick and snared. Oh, he needs to continue moving. What is he doing? Gets the engine snare. That Panzerk is still a threat to him. He does uh, decrew that AT gun. Kamatek does get a good hit there. And the Panzerk could get a shot off. Force far in the ground. It's suppressed. We're recovering suppression. And doesn't get the shot off. Whenever he had to recover from suppression, you need him sometimes to make another move order to get it out of that state. And I think that was the problem there. Another Panzer IV wouldn't be half bad. Brumbar couldn't be wouldn't be half bad either. Panzer Warfare wouldn't be half bad either. Ooh, that's gonna be a lot of repairs. We have been assigned fresh panzer grenadiers. Good hit there. And good suppression coming on out. Fresh panzer grenadiers, probably for panzer trucks, knowing his current playstyle. Soul section is going to go forward with a frag grenade. We'll get the frag grenade off. No, just regular smoke. I dropped Panzer Strike there. That was from the the sapper that dropped it. That'd be a great item for when the uh pioneers. But does pick it up with that squad. He could upgrade it. Now only the other Panzer for 50 munitions. Good hit there, frag grenade thrown. And he's going to sprint on out of there. Vickers here to cover. Let's see. Tiger Ace now fully repaired. Pack 40 gets a great hit. Six pounder does roll a bounce, and the Vickers almost goes down. Point. They're trying to take it. Almost goes down. Well done. Another comet take on the build queue. At this point, I say fireflies. I have, I prefer fireflies when it comes to anti infantry, uh, anti vehicle. Hello, mine's still there. Times of four, bet. Three gets a pen there by the comet tank. Bounce. Tiger Ace rotating over. Panzer Force two shots in. Grandier's here. Trying to get a Panzer Faust and we'll get the snare. AT guns rotating over. At least one of them is. Other comet tank trying to engage. Gets a good re armor hit there. This one's quite healthy. Crap, he needs to fall back to Tiger Ace. He won't be able to get the, when this game. And now with the loiter coming on in, he's going to try to body block it. Gets a good pen there. Could get another Faust off. Oh, wow. That went down really, really quick. Engine is snared. Pentrex moving forward. And the other pan truck has been upgraded. He has one more shot ready to go. The anti infantry loiter is way too powerful. It should be suppression, not damage. Because that was a reasonably health Panzer Grandeur. And just wiped out instantly. The 
enemy is attempting to steal our sector. He has plenty of fuel, just needs more manpower. We have a forward structure under attack. Pioneers ready for assignment. Frontier building has been lost. Our opponents are seizing a sector. Throws out frag, late response, but does retreat in time. Two great hits right there. And that miss could have actually got been pretty good as well. The enemy is attempting to steal our sector. Those retreat back there. We have a full Fresh pioneer. Looks like the flamer one went down as well. We oh, looks like he's actually upgrading remaining. this one with the flamer, not going for the minesweeper as well. AT gun, getting some good uh, not AT gun, vigors. Uh, I can't speak right now. My mind's being a bit fried. Let me get my drink. We're losing a Did I finish point. all my drink? Oh, there it is. Supply line's been cut. Both of these comp tanks are now fully repaired. As my frames are starting to die. Another telemine there. This could be a very, very good telemine. It's gonna be good. Fresh pack 40 as well. Bounces. Bounce. Double pen. Pack 40. Enemy pack 40. Rolls a miss. Blitzing on four. It's a bet three. Panzer four. Good pen there. Needs escape on out there. It can take two shots and not die. Good pen there. Good pen there. Blitzing on forward. Pack 40 gets a good hit. He can do a, do a snare. Four spot of ground. Rolls and miss. Foul slow. Very slow. Demo charge. Wipes out the infantry section. If your opponent's so busy microing tank, perfect time to throw out a demo charge. Going for the mortar team. Fires rifle grenade on the gunners and loader. Doesn't get the wipe. There it goes. Gets the wipe. MG42's Vickers making very hard to capture this side, uh, this center of the map. This one, mortar is blowing out some smoke. Oh, this mortar is just trying to hit that Vickers. Fresh Tiger Ace now out on the field. This squad's very punched up, a good hit. Ooh, I thought that was gonna be a wipe. For some reason I just thought that was gonna be a wipe. Good hits, going for the stun round, but I think the stun round is... 
fires stunned. Pack 40 going to point blank, getting some good hits. He could throw a stun round of his own. Rolls a bounce. Throws out white phosphorus as well. Hands a form. Nope, not going in. I do believe a Panzer Warfare would be pretty good right now. Does he have the pop cap for it? Eight, it costs like 16, right? 12. Much smaller than I thought. This Pioneer Squad will soon have its demo charge. He knows it's there, getting nice and close. Bowery threw out the demo charge. He couldn't be suppressed right now. Nope, this smoke. This uh, Grenadier Squad it will get suppressed. Satchel charge thrown, grenade thrown. Ooh, that his uh, positioning with his uh, Pioneer wasn't that great. No white phosphorus, no frag. Good hit there, direct hit on one of those models. Our capture point. They're trying to take it. Panzerborg getting a nice flank. Tiger Tank receiving a pen. Two pens. Forcing the radius. Pack 40s, reposition, Vickers gun, decrewed. Fresh common tank on the build queue. I still believe the fireflies would be a better option at this point. I know if the common has honestly a sort of absurd anti infantry. Panzer from the build queue. There we go. He realized that now these AT guns are getting very vetted and very being very problematic. This that's his biggest issue right now. Not the common tanks, but these AT guns. Panzer Warfare will make a say. No, you don't exist anymore. Good hit there. There's still plenty of tickets left as well. It's probably going to come down to one person surrendering after our big engagement. That sounded like a Panzer Grenadier. None of those are Panzer Grenadier models. Grenadiers are falling back. Panzer 4 moving the way forward. Building a... Uh, munitions cache. Which means he's going to have a hard time to recover if he loses his tanks. But right now, 52 munitions income to take a point from us. will allow him to get a loiter sooner rather than later because he knows how powerful that is. It's honestly a little bit too overpowered against infantry. Panzer Warfare. Excellent hits. An HMG crew has been lost to enemy action. Teller mine was interrupted. Could be destroyed by the random shots misses. This uh come take Giddings receiving some free shots from the pack 40. Tens of four could go down. Does go down. One of our panzers has been destroyed. No stun shot. Loiter coming on in. Tiger Ace outside the loiter radius by moving forward. Pack 40 doing some serious work against it. Gave some good hits there with the Tiger Ace. Rolls a bounce there. And rolls a miss there. Those go down and abandon in the, uh, in the base as well. 
abandoned should just be removed from the game. And now, he sacrifices King, uh, Tiger Ace for nothing, so he's probably going to cast the GG because he lost both of his tanks and got nothing for it. And lost a lot of infantry as well. Either way, this is John saying thank you for watching and signing off.